Ah uh, yes, recording. Hello. Don't tell anybody, but I'm your favourite fucking idiot, Cortana the Light and Cat. Just a little secret. Don't you fucking tell anyone. Aye? Okay? Why am I noticing dust everywhere? Ah, yeah, that's right. A little bit of OCD has returned. That's gonna get worse from here on out. Much worse. Not your problem to deal with, it's mine. Don't worry about it. <clears throat> now. For the past... Four days... My internet's been completely out. That started with uh, a storm and a thingy and a surge and a, a fried internal component of, of a, uh, a, a gateway. And apparently it did something to the line and they've got a technician supposed to come out sometime today. Hmm. Also, hold on a tick. Yeah, okay. I've been without some tobacco to smoke for three days. Four days without internet? Yeah, okay, fine. I can do that. I just popped in Skyrim on my 360 and had a go at it, and right now I'm watching fucking um, Star Trek Voyager. You got DVDs and shit. No fucking problem. However, two subject matters. Uh, the ability to play Steam in offline mode does not exist for me. Neither does playing Skyrim on the save files that I want to continue on the Xbox One. Neither is that an option for me, or any other game on the Xbox One for that matter. Subject matter number the second. Nicotine is a neurotoxin. It is an addiction. Don't know what anyone wants to say, and it's not. It is. Same as caffeine. I think it's in the uh, suffix. The I-N-E. I think that that, if I'm not mistaken in biochemistry, relates specifically to uh, an arrangement of the atoms into the formations of molecules. You know, which they could say a long, really long list of naming off each individual atom and how many of it are in sequence. <clears throat> but it, it's like, um, it's like saying nitrous instead of nitrous dioxide. NO2. Which, you know, up until some idiots kept using extended bursts of it, used to be used as a, an accelerant for vehicles for increased speeds for short bursts until one idiot blew himself the fuck up. Now, not so much. Yeah, the, the gearheads have really toned down on their use of nitrous oxide. However, nitrous oxide acts as a vascular dilator. And people I've went to the gym and worked out with actually use a a wee nip of nitrous oxide and they sell it as pills you know biochemistry aside caffeine and nicotine don't you find it odd that the the, the ending of both of them is in and that they both act on neurochemistry the way they do 
like, uh, yeah, yeah, Dr. Pepper, yeah, fucking caffeine and that, your fucking coffee, caffeine and that, they put it in damn near everything. Yeah, I am addicted. Even though I'm not uh, fully inhaling it deep into my lungs and holding it. It is getting into my bloodstream. Through the mucosal, muc mucosal membranes. Sublingual. Yeah, it's getting in that way. Under the tongue, basically. Yeah, I could go into a big spliel and explain it all, but nah, nah. Suffice to say, anyone who tells you that caffeine or nicotine are, are not addictive, they're talking out of their fucking ass. And I have heard some YouTubers say this. I don't remember who it was specifically, but it was one of these that I'm going to list off because I don't remember precisely which one it was. It was either Jim Sterling, Upper Echelon Games, Young Yeah, or Clean Prince Gaming. One of you has got your head shoved so far up your own fucking ass that you believe that nicotine is not an addiction when it is a neurotoxin. It, that's all I have to say. I can live without the internet. I'm doing that right now. And continuing with the hopes that I will eventually get it back today. And I keep turning this around to check to see if the ISP is calling. Because they're going to do that before they send the technician out. So cheers everybody. To whatever addiction ails you. Fuck the assholes who want to exploit it. Like EA. Yeah, I still give a fuck, so I'm still saying something about it. Hey, um, Young Yeah, Clean Prince Gaming, uh, Upper Echelon Games, um, The Quartering, fucking uh, Jim Sterling. Hey, yeah, you've raised a fuss. And now EA is standing in front of Parliament trying to justify itself and flailing like a fish out of water. You've accomplished your goal. But stop lashing out. Stop beating a dead horse. Okay? I'm having to talk to you like this because you're acting like little children. You're bitching and whining and continuing because you believe that the the people in charge, as it were, aren't going to listen to you. Well, EA's in front of Parliament answering for their bullshit. No matter what happens, the end user, as long as that EULA, and as long as DRM is a thing, this is the next topics you should be focusing on. The EULA and the DRM digital rights media protection bullshit. Yeah, this all started because, you know, companies wanted to assert their dominance over everything and, and proclaim that they're in charge. It's all bullshit control for money. Yeah, yeah, okay. We get it, okay? Everybody, we fucking get it. Companies need fucking money to do things. I've got a friend who's in the fucking industry telling me every day that I'm, I was online every fucking day for a fucking full month every fucking detail of this shit I don't know why Jim Sterling decided to lump basic microtransactions in his uh, video a couple of days ago well for me I watched it a few days ago let's just say last week or so ago for whenever this video actually manages to go the fuck out don't know why you lumped in screenshots of standard microtransactions for exchanging 
legal tender for a digital product in with fucking gambling mechanics and loot boxes. Don't know why you fucking did that. You're lashing out. You're shoving your head up your own fucking ass like this, okay? Yeah, this is what the fuck you're doing. You should stop that. did make a video saying you should go on vacation. I don't remember if I published that video before my internet fucked up entirely. But, I have another video, and then this one that I'm making right now to put out as soon as I get my internet back up. It's a fucking headache trying to keep track of all these things. Anyway, I am ready to just say I fucking quit. I really am. I'm ready to say I fucking quit. I'm tired of telling everyone, hey, stop, stop doing that. Do it this way. On my previous channel, I fucking hammered out countless ideas because I didn't bother counting them for... Whoever the fuck was in charge of Destiny when I was playing that. I hammered out ideas for fucking uh, Warframe, which is now I'm going to call Grindframe. And now when I go and take a shit, I call it a surprise mechanic and I call the toilet EA. It's just the way fucking things are going. I'm a daft fucking cunt. Daft. That in, that's in itself daft. That's neither good nor bad. It's just a way of saying I'm all sixes and sevens. Sixes and sevens. I'm fucking mental. I quite like that. I'm insane and I'm comfortable with it. I am functionally insane by your standards. By my own standards, I am completely fucked. And of course, I haven't really consulted my own standards in quite some time. I probably should do that. That would help alleviate a lot of worry with a lot of people. Yeah, especially those bugging ass hats at the Bilderberg group. Well, that might help them alleviate some of their concern. I doubt it. But it's worth a shot. So, ass hats in charge. People of Earth. Where the fuck do you want to go from here? I've already told you in a video previous to this, I'll work with you, but for fuck's sake, you haven't said or sent a goddamn message. I'm at the verge of choosing to interpret your absolute silence as a big fuck you. I know all the fucking problems. And I, I, I know all the fucking problems that are out there. Since you all want to handle it yourself, I'm ready to say I quit and I'll leave this fucking planet and leave all of you to the shitstorm that you've brought on yourself. I really fucking will. I'll never come back. Ever. I'll take my buddy with me. By force. I don't give a fuck what he wants. If I'm leaving, he's coming with me. I don't give a fuck what's going on. If I'm leaving, you're coming with me and you know who the fuck you are. And we're never coming back to this shithole. Fuck it. If nobody wants to work with me and fix this shit, then fuck it. 
They can all have their fucking shit cake and fuck it too. Yeah, that's the way Jim Sterling put it. They want to have their cake and fuck it too. Well, since everyone wants to have their cake and fuck it too and say fuck you to everyone else who says a goddamn thing to them, fine. That's what I'm ready to do. Is say fuck it all and leave and never come back. I really fucking will. I'm not gonna like that. But I'll fucking do it. Well, till next time. Hopefully asshats in charge say something. Get at least a fucking dialogue going, you know?